Third, I, I, is this I a third rematch? Have you uh, no, because they've been lost to Saber. No, it was Saber. Was and it, Harry beat me, then lost to Saber. He won the Cena. Um, so going into this matchup, I hope that A Bitman's not marrying too much because you see now up to rising up air can react to it pretty normally. Yeah, I, I can see Lucina just because like Rob doesn't want to be too close, so Roy Roy Sword isn't gonna do anything. anything. Okay. Nice. Um, he he didn't even get the yeah. He didn't even get the um, the gyro throw, but he still went for the side B. I wonder if he's reacting to it. So yeah, like, Lucina's really good at pushing advantage against Rob, so I want to see Avi do a lot of, I'll say, vertical juggling, which I call it. Um, even horizontally, like right now, he's pushing advantage. Nice reaction from Avi, using F tilt, low commitment. But I would have went for the grab and backed on Avi instead of going for side B. Right. Uh, he has no yeah, jump. Yeah, at least that. Yeah, you don't need side B for that one. Yeah. <laughs> Which he could have totally done, he probably would have made it back. Considering he used his jump already, I would have just attacked, like, and hope that I don't lose. Okay. Yeah, that's Cause, true. Because air dodge is the main thing that Rob could cover easily with side B and his four there. But 131 is nothing too shy that Javi can't bring back. And like I said about the up air, like, I want to see Brett just use the fast air dodge to land in neutral more, or just retreat to the ledge if he can't, because going for neutral air is assuming that your opponent it's not going to react to it, or I don't want to say bad, but like assuming that your opponent is not used to it. So it's like you pushing your character's advantage when you should be more playing the matchup. Right, okay. Javi getting the down air to kill. We got 8 man going for edge guards. Nice sweep, double jump, pulling back. He didn't want to be between Rob and the gyro. Yeah. I mean, he's been, been between like one or two times already, and that was not a good That was good bad, yeah. Game. That's why people will get hit by and be like, oh, Rob is so stupid. Like, I took 80%, but it's like, you know that the gyro is going gonna, is gonna to be on the ground, and you know Rob is going to run up and do it. So why would you put yourself yeah. in a situation to get hit by that? Ooh. He had the right read, um, but he, he released it too late. Javi's doing really good. Uh, uh, yeah. He did four there to get out of hit stun and got hit out of it. Common, yeah, like, common people can see. Yeah, that catches, that catches a lot of stuff. Oh. And punishing threat for, like I said before, mashing there and disadvantage. I wouldn't be surprised if that cost him the set. Attacking and disadvantage is both like really good and really bad in this game because once people know how to punish it, it's, it could either make or break some much. Yeah, depending on what moves you you can use on wherever like where your position because some moves like you can only do back air in certain situations but your back air is not good not good yeah oh uh, he had the read on the get up attack but landed on the platform yeah. nice on the pullback oh. one thing i want to see from having more i would say more grabs yeah, I, I noticed that he wasn't really grabbing, and, that, and that's what I wanted to ask. I know up throw got weakened by, from Lucina and Marth, but like, you know, not even to for percent, but not even for kill. But um, Brett is playing, well, A Bitman is playing in a way where he's like past mid percent. He only goes for follow ups, and if he's throwing out a safe one like neutral air or forward air, he would just chill. So we gotta get them out of our, out of the habit of you know stop grabbing, stop grabbing. You know, you Stop shooting, I mean, by grabbing them once or twice. I'm surprised that wasn't enough of a punish to where he caught the landing. But good, good on the side of it, but man. Could have played it better, I would say. Fix more as this advantage. Javi could... More landing neutral air, fast fall, which will force Rob to pick a more defensive option. And I would say more forward airs. I, I, I would say, like, off stage, uh, don't commit too much too early. Because, like, let's say Rob's off stage but above platform level. Mm -hmm. Like, you don't want to run off, do fair, and then you have to upbeat grab. Because yeah. then he's back on stage. Yeah, right and now. then he has... Yeah, like, bait stuff out. Track. Make him go down first or something. You know? Yeah, make him waste his guy. Because the Rob's are going to go for the one or two up airs. Try to scare you. Yeah. I try to make him do as much stuff as possible to just reduce his options more and more. So it's like stay at the ledge, then yeah, go exactly. off stage, yeah. Just, just literally beat a wall. Even if you just short hop fair or full hop fair. 
like, 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 like that, you're pretty much just keeping him at bay. If he didn't reverse that neutral, which I think was a missing, but he would have had a pretty yeah. good swing going because he caught the gyro. A good reacting to the full hop, getting forward there, getting a beat back because he held forward too, too early. Like right here, you see like what yeah, I do with yeah, the grabs and shooting? Yeah. Because yeah. Ibitman understands the pressure that Lucina gives, but he knows that Lucina grab doesn't really get anything past these percent, so you rather take it and take low percent and take an air load. And he hasn't grabbed yet, so yeah, like, yeah, so it's know, like there's not, no reason not, not to, to do it. Yet. Correct. That was a really good punish. I'm surprised he had enough time to dash and up smash when I'm falling back here. Did Zabi do like a Zabi do like a tilt? No, he did falling back here. And I know Lucina's landing back here is pretty safe. But I know Perry gives you like four or five frames on advantage, so you have to be like perfect on that punish. A good man keeping the spacing out. There, the shoot gyro shield. Yeah, Javi did a good job walking because you know if you run, you can't you can't shield, shield for, right away, for the and, initial, and you end up dash. walking into gyro. That's a good thing. Yeah. I need to remember to walk more. I don't know what sensitivity Javi has, but I need it. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I'm running out all, every single time. All right, good parry nice. jumping over. You see, on that parry, because Rob was at low percent, I'm assuming he wasn't paying attention to it. I would have went for up tilt instead, because Rob goes above you and could probably get an up air for it. Uh, oh, it's bad. Oh, thank God. I'm glad this yeah, is going to turn off. I probably stepped in the cord. No, the, the screen had turned off when it came back, but the stream should be fine. Uh, no, it depends up one. Yeah. I don't think he has a jump. He's forced to attack. Uh, yeah, he, he, he didn't, didn't mean know. to fast fall. Yeah, he didn't. That sucks. Either that or he didn't know he had a jump. And I also think it's losers finals. Yeah. You have it at semis. Well, this, well, this was semis. Can't, can't take Pokemon away from Russell. Can't. Can't take, no, no, was yeah, it? Yeah, because oh. Anathema's waiting in, in. Oh, in 